Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. Today I took a trip to HEB, which is a grocery store that is here in Texas. They do not have one in my area. So once a year I travel for a little over an hour and pick up some of my favorites. HEB has its own store brand, its own food, and the stuff is really good. Think of it as a Trader Joe's, but a lot bigger. So let me get started. By the way, this grocery haul, I'm gonna show you all the cold stuff and then I'll come back and show you the non-perishable stuff. So I got a couple of pizzas. Now these are new to me, Midtown Pizza. I think they're out of Austin, don't quote me on that. But I got their margarita pizza and then I also got their smoked brisket and sausage pizza. Howard and I both like brisket. The reason I wanted to give this a try is because the sauce is not a barbecue sauce. Um, I don't think, um, and I don't really like barbecue sauce on a pizza. I think this is just a regular tomato base. And you get pickled red onion, mozzarella, cheddar, brisket, chopped beef, pork, and sauce. I'm sorry, smoked pork and beef sausage. So you get that. And then their macaroni and cheese also looked good. I haven't tried that before. So I wanted to give it a try. I got some of their Asian frozen meals and we have had these before and we like them a lot. One thing about HEB is that their food is pretty, in or their groceries I should say, are pretty inexpensive, at least um, as inexpensive as Walmart or less than Walmart. So these um, Asian meals, I think were $5 and something and it's 24 ounces, so that's a pretty good size. I got sesame chicken. I got General Tso's chicken and orange chicken. These are all skillet meals. And then I also wanted to give their sugar cookies a try. This is their brand of sugar cookies. Wanted to give that a try. And then I got their breakfast flautas. I have had these before and they are really good. It's a crispy shell and the ones that I got are brisket, egg and cheese, and then also bacon, egg and cheese. They have bean. I think they also have, may have a potato. They have sausage as well. So these are really good. They're a pretty good size. You do microwave them and they have a little sleeve um, that crisp in the microwave and it works really well because normally I don't like microwave stuff but these are really good. So I got that. I wanted to give their egg rolls a try and their spring rolls a try. Um, so I'm excited to try these out. I got a couple of different lunch meats. I got some pepperoni and these are actually sandwich, um, sandwich size slices and this is what they look like. So they're pretty good slices. And then I wanted to try this um, jalapeno turkey breast and it looked really good to me. I've never seen jalapeno uh, turkey breast. So trying to, you can kind of see the little flecks of the jalapeno in there. So I got that. And then I also got their mesquite smoked ham. And I don't think I've tried any of their lunch meat before. So excited to give that a try. I got a couple of salad kits. So I have not seen this particular flavor locally in any brand of salad. So this is Sweet Thai. And I usually get Asian salad kits and this one sounded good. You get cabbage, green leaf lettuce, kale, carrots, green onion, peanut vinaigrette, honey almond, um, sweet sesame cashews and chow mein noodles, so that looked good. And then I also got this sweet garden crunch and it's just the, just the um, lettuce, so there's no salad dressing in there. But you get cabbage, lettuce, kale, red cabbage, carrots and green onions. Those are all things that I really like in my salad. I picked up a couple of their queso. Um, so I got the Blanco. Let me try to flip it around, here it is. So I got their Blanco. And you can see what it has in there, tomatoes, green chili, and jalapenos. And then I got their classic queso, which has, um, same thing, except it has roasted jalapeno peppers. And then I wanted to give their green onion dip a try and their French onion dip a try. Also got some beef brisket hot dogs. That sounded really good to me. Howard and I both love brisket. And then I also got some um, thin sliced New York extra sharp cheddar for some burgers. I grabbed just a package of their pre-cooked bacon. 
And then I also grabbed some turkey thighs. I have not been able to find turkey thighs locally. I'm not a huge turkey fan, but I do like thighs. And I found the very last pack that they had in stock. All right, so I'm gonna put this stuff away and then show you all of the rest of the groceries. Okay, so I grabbed some unsalted tortilla chips. The only place that I have ever found these is at HEB, so I always grab a bag when I go. And then I grabbed um, a bag of their Texas dippers. These are like Fritos. And then um, just the regular quote unquote Fritos that are lightly salted. And when you buy two bags of chips, then you get a free six pack of um, their brand of soda. So Howard chose the, like their knockoff Dr. Pepper, but they had, you know, like lemon lime, etc. So he got that. And then um, I just wanted to try their ranch chips. And these are just the kind of like single serving size that they have by the, um, the checkout. I just wanted to see if I liked them or not. So I grabbed that grab some hamburger buns because we are going to have hamburger soon. And Harrison, as you can see, he's kind of punched a hamburger bun, so got that. And then I wanted to try these croutons because um, they just sounded good, cheese and garlic. And I like croutons, but they're so big. So what I do is I crush them and sprinkle them on my salads. And then I really like ramen and I can't find beef um, around here this brand so I grabbed two packages of that and then I also wanted to try their chow mein as well grabbed a box of their chai latte drink mix I love chai I don't like um, coffee but I do love chai and then let me go back right here I grabbed two boxes of these marinating bags um, they're large, as you can see, they're leak proof and you can stand them up. So when I'm marinating chicken or any other meat or vegetable, it's easy to just put them in this bag and throw them in the refrigerator. I got several types of their sauces because I couldn't decide which one I wanted. So I got a spicy barbecue. I got a um, Korean barbecue. And then I got their teriyaki and um, let's see, that's it for that. And then I also grabbed a um, jar of this saucy Cajun. Howard really likes this, so I grabbed this for him. And then I grabbed two bottles of this Hawaiian barbecue sauce. We really like it a lot. And you really can't find it anywhere except online. So it's probably our favorite barbecue sauce. So I grabbed two bags. Let me go back here. So I have been looking for this Suave grapefruit scrub forever. They had it there, so I was excited. I love grapefruit and this smells so good. And then I got three bottles of their seasonal dishwashing soap. We do still wash our dishes by hand. So I got white sage, snow angel, and mistletoe. And they all smell really good. I got a bag of um, goldfish for Harrison. He likes them and I just grabbed them since he's almost out since I was there. And I really love this Krusty's um, Butter Vanilla Sugar Cookie Mix and you can't find it in my area of Texas so I grabbed it and it's really cheap there, like $1.68. I grabbed some of um, these granola bars, salted caramel. I don't think I've tried it before, but I love caramel. And then I just grabbed a box of their mac and cheese. I do like their mac and cheese. I grabbed another box of um, granola bars. This is a flavor I've not seen before, shaved coconut and almond. And I really like kind bars. So I figured I would like these too. It's a little bit different than a kind bar, of course, but it just sounded good. I got three boxes of these um, soft baked oatmeal squares. Harrison loves these things and they are really hard to find in my area. I mean, it doesn't matter which grocery store I go to, they never have them. So I saw them there and I grabbed three boxes. I grabbed a couple of boxes of their macaroni and cheese. I got white cheddar and then I also got the spiral. Grabbed some parchment paper and these are the pre-cut sheets. 
and then I saw these, had to try them. I love Reese's and I also love peanut brittle. And these are peanut brittle flavored Reese's. So that sounded good. And then I got a couple of different trail mixes. I got Hit the Tropics for Howard, Roasted Almonds, Coconut Toffee Cashews, Papaya, Pineapple, and Banana Chips. And then I got me the Honey Roasted Peanuts, um, Yogurt Flavored Peanuts, Dark Chocolate Raisins, Butter Toffee Peanuts, and Praline Pecans, the Nutty Bliss. All right, so let me put this stuff up and I'll get the rest of the groceries. Okay, so here's the last of it. I grabbed some of these quilted napkins for Christmas to put on our table. And then also grab some of this snack mix. It sounded really good to me. I love these kind of mixes. And this is skillet queso. Um, you get skillet queso toasted corn, corn squares, cheddar sesame sticks, and corn sticks. And then I also wanted to try um, these red beans out, Cajun style. So it comes with the red beans and the seasoning package in there. Um, these are two new flavors that I wanted to try. I'm not a big instant potato person, but these flavors sounded really good and I do like this brand. So I got Vermont white cheddar and then Wisconsin cheddar. I got um, Howard some avocados. Uh, these are actually pretty decent in size, and they say that they're small. They were only 48 cents each, so that was pretty cheap to me. And then I also got a tomato for Howard as well. We're going to be having burgers. I grabbed some onion salt. This is hard to find around here for some reason, so I grabbed a big thing of onion salt. I grabbed a couple of um, these cooking sauces. So I got a beef stew, and then I also got Mongolian style sauce as well. I got Howard some of these colossal peanuts. He loves to shell his own peanuts. You probably can't tell in the camera, but they are really big, a lot bigger than the regular size peanuts. I saw these two Parmesan cheeses and I wanted to give them a try. This is three cheese and you get Parmesan, Romano, and Asiago. And then this one is Parmesan with spice, so it has red pepper and other stuff in there and it sounded good. I got a bag of these hot sauce cheese puffs. These are, are new, or maybe they're seasonal, but I don't think they're around all the time, but I wanted to try them. And then I got Harrison, who is a very picky eater. I thought maybe he would eat apple sauce in a, you know, like in one of these pouches, cause he won't eat it any other way. So just wanted to try him out on that. And then I also wanted to try out this borracho bean seasoning. I love borracho beans, so I got some of that. Um, looked, I uh, was looking for um, ham bouillon because I can't find it around here, so they had it there, grabbed it. And then wanted to try their ultra crisp, I'm sorry, ultra thin and crispy pizza crust. You get three of them in there, and I know you can't tell, but they are pretty thin, so excited to give these a try. I needed a little mini whisk, and I think this was only two bucks, so I grabbed it. And then I saw this dish drying mat. This is what it looks like. We do still hand wash our dishes, dishes of course, and I, it seems like I always need extra space um, or extra room to dry dishes around the holidays, so I just grabbed this to pull it out when I needed it. And then I got a bunch of canned items. So I got a um, thing of white cheddar cheese condensed soup. I got some refried beans with jalapenos and their charro beans, which Howard and I really like a lot. I got a couple of cans of cut green beans. I got this soup because it looked really good. Um, chicken queso blanco. So it says a creamy white cheddar cheese and chicken soup with corn and roasted poblano peppers. So this looked good to me. And I don't know how to make it. I'm trying to see. Oh, it says you can use water or milk. So I'm excited to give this a try. And then I grabbed some more refried beans and these are barracha or charro, sorry, charro beans. And then I grabbed two cans of cream of chicken. So this is everything that I picked up on my annual HEB haul. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please give us a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, please hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any videos. Thank you all so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time.